A terrifying crash caught on camera as a San Isidro man tells News 8 he survived what police are calling a malicious prank. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Alicia Summers. And I'm Steve Price. The man was riding his motorcycle on a local freeway when witnesses say someone rolled a tire into traffic, causing the man to crash his bike. News 8's LaMonica Peter spoke with that man who incredibly walked away without any major injuries. Imagine riding down the freeway on your motorcycle and a tire comes out of nowhere and knocks you off your bike. Well, that actually happened to one man while he was on the 5 freeway just before the 15 North, and now he's speaking out about the scary incident. I don't know where this tire came out and it was too quick to react. Servando Lopez says he's lucky to be alive after crashing his motorcycle while heading home just before noon on Tuesday. He says eyewitnesses told him what they saw. Two guys that stopped to help me told me that they saw somebody on the hill next to the freeway roll down the tire. A guy in a light gray shirt. I, I didn't see him though and I didn't see him in my video. Lopez actually caught his crash on a video recorder attached to his helmet. He says he wasn't seriously hurt, but he had to think fast after falling. My first thought was I got to get up. I got to get up. I got to get off of the freeway because I don't know what's going on behind me. There could be cars speeding. They could run me over. Fortunately, he says the cars did stop for him and the two witnesses helped him get off the freeway. Lopez says he went to urgent care to be examined and had his motorcycle towed home. Pretty much now he just wants motorcyclists to be on the lookout and to remember this important tip. I think the biggest takeaway from this is for motorcyclists to wear their gear because I hit the ground pretty hard. And you can see my helmet is scratched up, my jacket is scratched up. But if I hadn't been wearing that, I would have been in way worse condition. Lopez says CHP did arrive on the scene and search for the guy witnesses saw on the hill, but they didn't find him. He also told me that he's been riding a motorcycle for six years and he does plan to buy another one. But for now, he's going to take a little break from riding bikes.